Working with former players is such a joy. I'm gonna backpedal, I'm gonna read that my defender has slid to her, and then I'm gonna demand it. She's timing my cradle and just checking, yep. It's really special to see their growth just in their time here as a student athlete, right? From the freshman year to their senior year, fifth year, they're completely different people. So then to get to continue kind of that daily journey with them every day is something that's really special. And I think it gives us a little bit of an advantage, I would say, because they understand the program, they understand what we value, they understand the process and how we do things. With me, Hannah and Lizzie, uh, it's just a connection that you don't have to take time for. It's something that's already there. It's very natural. My role is focusing on the offense and getting it to run smoothly, but also at the same time, putting Liberty Lacrosse on the map and specifically uh, scoring early and often. Guys, we're huge threats. Okay, and let's expose the hedge. We're gonna really enjoy it. Also, just know this game is ours. Continue to cook, guys. Let's go, come on. Just like that, the Flames come out of the gates hot in quarter number two. Way to crush the boards, Katie, great job. I found that the team that really has more fun wins. As a player, I might not have always done that. So as a coach, it's my job to be like, hey, stay weird. You got to smile when you're out there. You got to throw down your stick like, you know, it's the first time you've ever scored because truly you don't know when it's your last. Just like that, back to back to back for the Flames. There's so many things that Nina brings and a lot of stuff that she does really goes unnoticed. She's the backbone, she's consistent. That is so huge especially with our 18 and 22 year old kids. So much of it is consistency and Nina is the definition of that. When I talk about them living and breathing Liberty the Cross, she is a testament to that. Yes, Katie! Let's go, Lori, let's go! Ball goes out, then you're out. Okay. Like instead of being, be kind of like already angled okay. out. This year, I'm kind of more in charge of the defense. That's where my heart is. I love defense. I played defense my last year. Yes, Laura! You cannot catch Hannah on a bad day. She just has so much fun. She has a servant's heart because every day she's here and willing to kind of help any way she can. Like still, when you make contact at six to six, your feet are right here. You're not like releasing this contact, but then you're just like, that way you're not like lunging your whole body. She's younger, she was just there. Um, she has a little bit more of a sense of what they want slash need maybe than we would. So it's nice to kind of have just a different kind of opinion in the room. It's been really awesome to see her confidence and like her leadership muscles kind of grow and evolve. So they'll drive and look to feed number 22 who's right here. Something I just want you guys to focus on is just like making sure our pressure and try and go on ball is like elite, especially in the pies. I am the team shepherd and basically every team has an athletic shepherd and they get to be sort of a spiritual mentor is how I describe it. Lizzie brings credibility because she's fresh off the field. She's an All-American. She's worked her way onto the field because she was a walk-on. She was going to come here and play volleyball, and God kind of opened a different door, and thank God that he did. She worked her way onto the field. Nothing was handed to her, and I think a lot of the girls saw that. Ferguson lets it fly for her fifth goal of the day. They resonate with her. They see, okay, here's a girl that worked really hard outside of practice, put herself on the field. And then when she put herself on the field, she didn't look back. She made herself undeniable. My job is to show up, love the girls and point them to Christ, which feels like such a gift to me. And you know, I don't have the responsibility of coaching them. I'm just here to love on them, which feels like such a gift. It's one thing for the girls to feel confident to come to us. We always want to make sure we have an open door policy. But in the event that they might not feel comfortable going to us, we know they feel comfortable going to Lizzie. And that's a relief. And we're really, really thankful to have her in that role. To have these girls want to stay with us and continue you know, the journey here is, I think, really special. And I think that's a testament to how much they care about this program, this place. They like live and breathe Liberty Lacrosse, and it's really special. My heart burns for this program because it's so much more. It's about Jesus, it's about community, it's about so many things. Why wouldn't you want to be a part of this program that changes people? It has changed my life personally. It's the greatest honor to get to work here, get to be a part of God's mission for this team, God's heart for these girls.